What's up, Leah? Thank you so much for tuning in. I'm your host, Atisha Yofo. If you guys haven't already joined the fan, please go ahead and smash that subscribe button and the bell right next to it. That way you don't miss some more energy updates from me. All right, guys, we're going to figure out your future boot thing. We're going to use our Vixen Terra After Dark deck here. That way we can figure out how they're looking, how they're smelling, what's going on. Do they have a job? Okay. <laughs> Or even if you guys are together, you know, you guys could have just started dating one another, okay? Or you've been together for a while, you just want to see, maybe you just re reconnected. Or maybe you just sitting at home and you're like, how am I supposed to meet my person when I don't go anywhere, you know? It could be at the gas station, it could be at the grocery store, you're like, how is this going to come, okay? Sometimes the divine will come in and just bring you them, okay? Alright. Okay, Leo. What's up with Leo? And check the other signs too, Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Um, the other videos to get a full rounded view of who your future boot thing would be. Okay. Oh, there we go. Page of Pentacles. Okay. This person's very observant, Leo. They look at everything. They look at your eyebrows, your eyelashes, your hair, the way you dress, like everything head to toe. Okay. Um, you know. They're not afraid to get their hands dirty either with work, okay? Um, you know, very responsible type of person. I like that, okay? They could be a little bit flaky with other people, but with you, that's like your priority if you're talking to this person. Or if you were to be in their life, they would put you first. Very independent type of energy. What else do we have for Leo? We have the death card here, okay? Uh, so this person definitely has everything balanced out and they know that everything's going to work out for them, okay? A lot of people were unfair to them and in their life. Um, and so they're taking matters into their own hands. The ball is definitely in their court with their life. So they're definitely seeking people that are very honest and truthful. Um, you know, they're taking accountability for maybe some actions that they've done if you are with them, okay? And it's like they're trying to claim their power back, okay? Um, you know, this person's definitely going to try and make a big impact. Um, they're going to be showing out, trying to buy you everything and pull out all the stops, okay, to keep you. Um, yeah, <laughs> most definitely. What else do we have for Leo? Let's take it. Devil card. You could be dealing with a Capricorn or an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo. Um, you know, and this person definitely... Uh, I feel as if they have to look in the mirror or they have been doing mirror work. It's like they definitely recognize there's certain patterns and behaviors that aren't going to work out in this new connection with you. They feel as if they have to be top notch, like they want you to have everything and they maybe might be falling back because they can't, um, you know, bring all of that for you. So, but they're, st they're, they're still ne never going to let this connection go. It's like you would have to cut this person off. Like, literally, because they're not going to, like, give up on you. But they know they can't be everything, okay? So they may fear the situation a little bit. They have a little bit of doubt in their mind about this connection. Um, this person could also have some addictions, possibly. Um, smoking, drinking, overeating, overworking. You know, any type of addiction, okay? Um, they're definitely very obsessed either over you or something. Uh, very obsessive type of energy, okay? But we do also have the Wheel of Fortune here that came out as well. So, you know, they have some good karma coming in, okay? Change is coming up, okay? This person might try and switch up. They have a lot of positive thinking. It's like, you know, they're trying to be the superhero in their own movie. They're trying to make a movie out of this, okay? They're trying to get rid of the old and in with the new. So this person might be getting rid of their current relationship that they're in or talking to other people. No more third parties. Like, they just want to have that one person, um... You know, they're going to a new phase in their life and they're really trying to embrace it at this time. So, um, they they feel as if they're where they're supposed to be if it's with you. We also have the sun card here as well, okay? So, yeah, this person's definitely bringing in a lot of light. They want to just say goodbye to the dark lifestyle. They want to radiate positive vibes because they're filled with, you know, so much warmth and love. It's like, you know... People can't definitely get, get enough of their energy. So they might be very popular. People might know them very well. You guys might have mutual friends. You know, it's like um, they're very grateful for the little things. Like they just want to spend time with you, spend time with their loved ones, with family, you know, having fun with the homies. Like they just want to be out chilling, like 
and they just want to enjoy your company if you guys are together or talking okay a lot of things are happening right now with this person yeah look at that two of cups came out <laughs> a lot of major arcana here but two of cups bam it's like are you already dating this person leo you might already be out on a date with them um they might be taking you out whining and dining um you know they feel as if they're better they feel like being with you like you guys are better together or they can see themselves with you like man we can just like rule the world together like we can be in business together we can have good sex together we can be friends together like we can be the whole piece of the pie so this person definitely feels as if they can be their full selves around you and with you and they totally trust you so that's really good and if you are with them this 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 relationship is gonna last look at that yeah because this person's been carrying a lot of weight on their shoulders, okay? So they could also be having a lot of things going on. I don't know what it is, but, you know, um, this person could have did something where somebody turned on them or, you know, they've been thinking negative thoughts. They're not super positive. Maybe somebody's breathing down their neck. I don't know. Um, maybe a past relationship or an ex or something like that. Um, you know, it's like they don't want to fill their mind with negative bullshit, so they try and, like, be funny. So you might be dealing with like, someone that likes to crack jokes a lot, you know, or doesn't really like to talk serious all the time. Like, they want to have fun and laugh. Like, they don't want any negative type of energy. What else do we have for Leo? Leo's future food thanks for what we got. What they looking like? How are they feeling? Do they have a job? What's going on? Okay. Yeah, they're definitely in some bumper lanes. There's something that's kind of keeping them not to go all the way in, but they definitely are balanced. Um, I feel as if this person does have options, okay? And <clears throat> they're being guided to you. Um you know, and if you guys are together, just remember there's strength in this connection if you guys are with this person. There's definitely, a, you guys hold a lot of good memories versus bad. So you guys can still hold on. There's still something to claim here, okay? Yeah, you guys could have been friends and then lovers. So there's still a strong bond, okay? Yeah, look, three of wands right after that. Yeah, they definitely have lots of friends and family that support them um with this connection it's like they know you they adore you they like you or they're gonna sh they're gonna tell their friends about you <laughs> and talk about you um they're definitely not afraid to lean on somebody and trust them with you know what they're doing or they wish they could talk to somebody but definitely still an independent type of person um if, but if you guys are together i feel as if you guys mutual friends everyone's connected it's like squad goals like everyone gets along like you know it's like a good time you guys are kicking at the house or wherever you guys go you guys definitely have some mutual friends and mutual connections where you guys all get along look at that lover's card oh don't we love to see it so yeah you got <laughs> this person has a ton of love to give to you um, there's a connection that's growing into what, what they want. Like this connection is everything that they want. Okay. Um, they have lots of high energy. It's like this person wants to be, whether you're in a situation ship, a marriage, a relationship, business partnership, whatever this is, it's like, you guys are definitely hitting it off or you're going to hit it off. Okay. <clears throat> it's like, you guys are getting super close or you are super close already, or you're going to, it's like, you know, this person is definitely listening to their heart and they want you to listen to yours. Okay. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> there is an instinct just a little bit they do feel something maybe is off so maybe they feel as if you have options or you're out there and you're just not they're not the only one so they feel as if there could be some curveballs thrown in and maybe it's all in their head so this person like i said we already knew that this person does have a little bit of doubt um uh, so they're definitely watching their back they're sticking to their goals but if you guys are together to see 9 11 um you guys are going to rise above this if you guys are together and you're thinking something's going on. What else do we have for Leo? Yeah, so you're dealing with someone that's very classy, very mature type of energy. 
Um, they're also very creative, very organized, okay? They do have goals. Like, this person is all about the bag, okay? As they should, okay? People are very drawn to their energy that they have here, okay? They're very comforting to be around. Like, you feel hella comfortable being around this person. So, you must know who exactly who this is. It's like when you guys talk, when you guys hang out, it's like effortless type of energy. It's effortless. So, this is a really good connection. Yeah, King of Cups, okay? They're out there getting it, okay? They really take care of themselves. They know how to take care of their family, um, you know, it's like they want to support everyone, but sometimes they got to take care of themselves. So this person could put everything before them, you know, so they, they kind of got to work on that. But that's a good thing, though, in a sense, because they would put you first as well. So they may need a shoulder to lean on. OK, if you guys are together, maybe this person, you know, tell them to take some time for themselves. Go, go out, do something, you know. Would you also have the Hermit card? Yeah, this person doesn't mind being in their own energy, being alone. Um, they don't mind doing things on their own, okay? Sometimes they just want to be in their own bubble. Um, so, you know, that's how they feel. Possibly this can be just a right now thing, you know. It's like, from time to time, it's like, they really need to love on themselves. I feel like, you know, they don't give themselves enough credit, okay? So, yeah, you could be dealing with somebody that needs maybe a little bit of reassurance, you know, letting them know, like, who you are to them, how you feel about them. I just seen 1111 again, okay? So, yeah, they really want to align their desires with your soul. They want to, like, treat you like gold. Like, they want, they want to, like, they just feel you deserve everything, I feel like. They just want to do what feels good. Yeah. This person definitely has some money, okay? Um, so this is like a huge, this is a huge deal. This could be a connection that the universe brought together. Like you guys will, it's a connection that will never die out. It's always going to be forever. Or this could just be that someone is coming in and they're going to be very patient with you. They're going to walk in gratitude. It's going to be a whole surprise to you. You're not even going to realize like, what? Like this is the person? So somebody might be coming in. And they're not going to have no drama. There's not going to be any hardships, no baggage. They're just going to come in. And it's going to be very stable, okay? This is a very passionate person that's coming to you, Leo. Anything else Leo needs to know about their future book thing? Yeah. Yeah, this person definitely has went through a lot. Or they have, they're going through a lot when they come to you. I feel like they have the weight of the world on their shoulders. Um, but when they come in, you can handle it. You're tough. You know how to give them advice. You know what I mean? It's not going to be like, you know what I mean? You're going to love on them the way that you should love on them. And you're just going to get them. And they're going to get you. All right, Leo, thank you so much for tuning in. If you want to get this extended, go to VixenTaraForDark.com to get your personalized reading. They're only 22 bucks. Don't forget to like this video. Comment down below. Let me know how your future boot thing is going. And subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one. Peace.